today we're going to be learning to skip this activity. All you need is enough space to move in and a couple of cones which you can, or other markers which you can set however far apart you want depending on what space you've got. So specifically we're going to be skipping for height and skipping for distance. Let's start by skipping for height. Now let's try skipping for distance. So as a challenge this time, I want you to see how few skips you can use to get from your first marker to your second marker. Remember to really drive your arms and knees forwards and upwards. Drive your arms and your knees up and to push off the ground with your toes.